whatever reason you're here, we're gonna go ahead and talk about some quick, easy tips on how to write a short film so that you can go out and do that and tell your story. Tell your story to the world. So when you're writing this story, uh, you can't have a story without characters, right? You need to think about your characters and also that idea and scenario. So a lot of people start with character building, right? Uh, me, I'm more of a scenario dude first. I like to write out kind of the scenario and how it plays out. And then I fill in like what's gonna be the funniest or the most interesting character in this specific scenario. You think about your characters, who's your protagonist? Um, are they relatable? Why do we like them? Why do we care about their story? Uh, who's the antagonist? Is there an antagonist that's gonna be in the story? Who are the supporting characters? Well, you know, think, think about your characters and try to live in the character's shoes. You know, how do they talk? Uh, what do they kind of, what do you feel like they look like? How do they dress? How do they carry themselves? All these things are gonna come into play when you're writing your story. And as you fill in your character and build your character, it will just give more authenticity to your short, to your film. So think about that. And when I say ideas and scenario, you know, what, where do they find them and what are they going to be doing? What's kind of the, the conflict, right? Not, not a scenario of they're walking down the street, no. They're walking down the street and then a car is wheeling off the road and about to hit them. That's a little bit more of a scenario. They're going to the grocery store and then the, the cashier gets held up at the grocery store by gunpoint. That's a scenario. And that's going to come into play later when we talk about uh, concepts and log lines. Pick a genre. <clears throat> if you pick a genre, it's going to help you hone in on your story and how you tell your story. It could be like a horror, it could be um, a romance, it could be a comedy, it could be a dramedy. This genre really does affect how you're gonna tell your story. So you can be that person saying, well, I got a personal story I want to tell, da 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 Cool. So let's say uh, you want to write about the time you lost your dog. Has it really affected you as a human being and how you are today? Uh, the story could be like, a boy found out his dog Lucy ran away. So he went out into the forest to chase him, and he sees Lucy's collar in front of a dark portal. The boy jumps into the portal and now he has to save Lucy from evil demon monster thingies that are trying to kill him. And we'll try to kill his whole family if he does not defeat them. Bam! Wait a minute. I, I think I'd, I'd write that. Boy, demon, port. Yeah, no, I would watch that on Netflix on a holiday break for sure. But yeah, genre definitely um, affects it. Or it could be a, a romance instead of a horror dog Lucy thingy. Girl loses Lucas, the dog, and then finds Lucas playing with a handsome Prince Charming guy. Boom, romance, whatever. So pick a genre. Next, theme, your moral of your story. What are you trying to convey? What are you trying to tell? this story, right? It needs a theme or a moral, like a, what is it? All good just always overcomes evil in the end, or um, love is stupid, or um, I, don't, I don't, something, some, something. You need, you need some type of theme, some type of moral of your story to tell. Another thing to keep in mind, Yes, budget. So those, 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 those three explosions that you want in your story, that, that action car chase you want in your story. Um, what else in that story? Uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger in your story. Just take those things, ball them up, put them in a box, right? Open the box, put them in the box, close the box, write, for later and push that to the side off the table off just push that off the table it's there that's down on the floor i'm sorry 
right in your budget. Uh, think about locations, right? Do you, do you, can you, can you pay for those locations? Can you pay for these actors and extras? How many actors can you pay for? Or do you have friends that can help you? Or do you have cool locations? Or your friends have cool locations? You know, that buddy that owns a motel. Keep all those in mind when you're writing your script. A budget. 